Chris Holder off the inside in red. Bartosz Marsnik in uh, gate number two. Confirmation it is Joseph Frank off gate three in white, as I suspected. And trudging his way back across the centre green. Suddenly, he's in a really good opportunity here to make the semi-finals. Holder's made a good gate there from the inside. Now Holder will go mid-track. That allows Svarsnik a chance to dive up the inside here. And coming through is Zagar in yellow as well. Zagar has just pipped Svarsnik. The man at the back here is Joseph Frag. Oh. But it is Chris Holder who has the lead, and Svarsnik oh. has come back through. Oh, this is absolutely chaotic once again. Oh. Svarsnik in blue. Zagar in yellow. <laughs> They're just about staying on the bike. But Chris Holder, who crashed earlier and was on the uh, on the shale and looked in trouble, well, he is on the verge of a semi-final spot, and full credit to him. Well, he has missed all the fireworks going on behind him because Smarslick had to work overtime to get the better of Zagar. Zagar now roaring around the outside. Holder's in front with Smarslick coming on really strong. Here comes Zagar again. Oh, my goodness, Zagar's through in the second oh. place. Must be the third time they've done that. Fantastic ride, Zagar lifts. Oh, really good stuff for second place. Oh, come on, boys, be careful, please. It's Chris Holder who's going to take the victory, and Zagar... Of them when he, when he was in three years ago, so needs a big night tonight. Antonio Lim back off one, Emil Seifutinov goes off two, Matty Zegar on that warning off gate three, and Matze Yanovsky will he pull off? Will this one go? Craig Ackroyd of Great Britain with his finger on the button here. Good start from Lim back, game number one looking good here. Watch out for Magic now off the outside, up the inside is Zegar in white. Now Lim back charging oh! out and off. What a move from the Russian, has the lead here in blue, and now Zegar's coming through as well! What a battle developing here, Grand Prix Speedway in Denmark, and Zegar has come through! And Saifutinov won't give up, but Lindbach has problems. Yeah, bike packed up down the back straight, brilliant move from Zegar to bounce to get the better of the Russian. Zegar now looking good, needs this win, really desperate for points in the World Championship, riding hard out in front. Yanovsky's back in third place, looking like it's beginning to settle down. And that's the go. Encouraging signs here for the Slovenian. Very much so. Mati Zegar, who was in the bottom half of the table on 26 points before this race, he's going to get three big points under his belt. Had to work hard with Zegar. Screwed together with 14 screws. It's a fantastic performance so far. Yeah, great stuff, Jason Doyle. Now, here we go with Heat 12. Ty Wolfenden off the inside. Piotr Pavlitsky, gate two. Freddie Lindgren, gate three in white. Matty Zagar off the outside. Lindgren on Thursday night. Heat number 12. Here we go. Wolfenden's made a good start for the inside gate. He's going to lock up as well. Lindgren is going to try the run around the outside. Pavlitsky almost catches Wolfenden. Lindgren has the lead. Magnificent ride from fast Freddie Lindgren. Wolfenden is locking the bike up, and that allows Zagar to come around. Side. The race is on. Lindgren appears to have it under oh. control. Wolfenden's gone wide. That has allowed Zagar round. And Pavlitsky has to get off the gas. Zagar coming on strong, really strong. Lindgren out in front. Wolfenden just got out battled there. Zagar once again running right round the outside. Freddie Lindgren slams the door shut. Oh, look at the speed that Zagar's got. Terrific action out in front. Here we go. A lap to go. Front. A battle at the front and a battle at the back as well. Here comes Zegar. He's got more speed than Lindgren. Oh! Tries the inside run. Lindgren's going to lock up the inside and try and get to the line. That is a great well, race. Matty Zegar could do with a couple of points. Kenneth Pierre, if he can get a win here, the wild card could make it on count back with two race wins. So uh, all to race for. Heat. Oh, and yeah. He was really looking forward to the night, but it just hasn't worked out. Zagar's been riding well, but had some sort of mechanical issue last time. Here we go. Yep, heat number 18. Vasilik has made a good one, but Smarsnik has got out of track two superbly now. Zagar at the inside, and now Pierre's going to oh. get off the gas. That was dangerous down the back straight. He's a oh. good job, he's oh. coming. Oh. Smarsnik's all over the place. He's got to the back. Zagar from Pierre. Smarslik back in the battle here with my oh! How on earth has he stayed on? That was What's some going lap. on? Well, that was some lap from Smarslik has recovered and is now back in third place. Remarkable from
the Polish man. They go around in front. Look at Bierdo. Bierdo is quick, really quick in second place. Bierdo knows he needs a win here, but Smarslik is closing in. How on earth is he doing this? It's like a stunt show. It's Matty <laughs> Zegar, the leader. Kenneth Pierre is high into the dirt. Smarslik's going to come and have a real go. It turns three and four. What's out for Smarslik? Zegar's going to get the win. Pierre. And he's off the inside gate here yeah. in red. Niels Christian Everson goes off gate number two in blue. Emil Saifutinov in a good bit of form now. Goes off gate three in white. And Matty Zegar goes off the outside in yellow after this heat. And here we go. Heat number four it is. Jason Doyle off the inside in red. Can he get there? Everson's made a great start from gate number two. Doyle holds the inside line. Now he's going to go wide, but Everson oh. has got the drop. But this is a great race for <laughs> Niels Christian Everson. And now on the inside comes Zegar. Matty Zegar has just got the better of Jason Doyle. Emil Saifutinov is in the back right now, but they're all bunching up as well. Zegar's fast in second place. Got the winner of Doyle coming out of turn four in the opening lap. Zegar again on the inside, coming on strong. Out the back is Emil Saifutinov, who did practice yesterday, the only rider not to. Everson out of gate two, gate two's been working well. Round the outside, Zagar, Zagar in the dirt, Everson up the inside, into the last lap, Zagar coming on strong, again round the outside, the Slovenian. Oh! oh brilliant speedway! Oh, that's a fabulous move from Zagar to hit the front. Zagar is going to get the victory here, wonderful! British FAM Speedway Grand Prix, it's Matty Zagar off the inside. And Ty Wolfen and off two, two race winners so far. Antonio Lindback, gate three in white, and Martin Vasilik off the outside in yellow. We've heard from Greg Hancock. Surgery, and then obviously there will be a problem potentially for being back in time, but he's going to have to take some advice from specialists in the very near future. So heat number five it is then here. We're seeing Wolfenden off gate number two in blue. Zegar super quick in his opening ride. Here we go. Heat number five and Zegar's made a beauty off the inside gate. And now cutting out the inside, charging hard, trying to get past Wolfenden. It's Vashilik, but Wolfenden holds second spot right now. Lindback charging hard up the inside. That's a clever move from Antonio Lindback charging up the inside of Martin Vashilik. But I'll tell you what, this man up front, Matty Zegar, looking Whoa. super quick. But he goes on one wheel and Wolfenden gains ground and now Wolfenden's going to try the inside run. We've got a race on here. They have indeed. Wolfenden coming on strong. Superstar initially from Zagar. Wolfenden now beginning to really apply the pressure. Certainly Lim back in third place. He isn't done as well. Lim back charging up the inside. Has he got the better of Wolfenden? Really tried for second place. Zagar into the last lap. Wolfenden up the inside. Zagar looking like he should just about Zegar's got the benefit of the outside run, which has cut in the speed to pull ahead now. Pull clear, more ahead. Zegar from Slovenia, unbeaten so far. Josh Bates from Barnsley in South Yorkshire. Gate number two. I said West Yorkshire earlier, and as a Yorkshireman myself, I should know better. Craig Cook, gate three white, and Bartosz Marslik off the outside in yellow. Here we go. Heat number 12. There will be a grading break after this one. Oh! It's Matty Zegar, Craig Cook has got the drop. Cook. That is a jet propelled start from Craig Cook in white. And now come on oh, the outside. It's Marslik <laughs> absolutely on a rocket ship here. <laughs> Look at him go. Craig Cook holds second place. Matty Zegar is third. And Josh Bates this time is at the back. And now Cook's going to come under some serious pressure from Matty Zegar in red. They were teammates last year at Bellevue in Manchester. And Zegar has come through into second now. And oh, oh. Very nearly ran in the back of Zagar Kirk. What a start it was from Craig Kirk. I thought he might have got a fly, but he was jet propelled. What a move from Smarslik down the back straight to get himself literally firing off the fence and down the back straight to get himself to the front. Zagar riding strongly for second place, but Smarslik meant business in this one. What a ride from the man in yellow. Have to show his composure now. Emil Saifutinov, Matt Zianovsky, Matty Zagar, Chris Holder. Same lineup. Yanovsky was not warned, but apart from Yanovsky, we'll be pleased because Josh Yanovsky was away. He was gone, absolutely. Here we go again then. Three right on. That time Yanovsky responds again. That's a great start. Oh, and Chris Holder loses it a little bit there, but he's got the outside.
inside, Robin has got speed onside, who can off as well. Chris Holder holds second place right now. The lead is with Matt Sienowski. Second place, Chris Holder and Zegar's coming through as well. Charging hard in the outside run. Zegar's got a lot of speed here. He's going to take up the running on Chris Holder. Oh. This is great stuff from Matty Zegar. Oh, he's come through into second place. What a ride from Zegar. Very stylish indeed round the outside. All credit to Janowski to remain composed. But Zegar's going for a win here. Zegar's like, oh, he nearly threw it away there, running in too far. Into the last lap, Janowski showing great composure, repeating the start from gate two. Zegar riding out of his skin to come through into second. Janowski is going to get into the final. But of justice, perhaps, there, you might argue. Like Janowski, Doyle and Zegar. Well, the final really is set up beautifully. The pressure for all to... Tense pressurised, it's a pressure cushion, cooker um, uh, pressure here tonight. Here we go, five second time of asking. Here we go then, yes indeed, and Janowski's made a beauty from gate number two. Now, can anybody catch Matt Janowski? Doyle's coming round into second spot right now. Which way will he go, inside or outside? Smarslik's not done yet. Smarslik's coming through to try and get a better at Doyle. Doyle's right up the exhaust pipe of Janowski. You cannot make a mistake here. All three riders up front, Ray right having a ding-dong. Second place is Doyle. Now Doyle's trying the inside run, but Janowski looks like he's got the race under control with a couple of laps to go. Only just going to say that Doyle's coming on strong. Great battle for second and third. Doyle has ridden strongly for that. Janowski, fantastic out of gate number two. He's going into the last lap in the Principality Stadium, looking like a winner to me. Doyle in second. Oh, Sparslick's backed up. Bit of disappointment for him, but Janowski's going to pick up a win. Magic, Matsy, Janowski wins in Cardiff.